Seven months after the court ruling, the NPA is yet to hand over abridged copies of the requested tapes to the DA. The party has also sought to have Parliament debate the issue without success. South Africa has witnessed an unparalleled abuse of state power, not witnessed since the end of apartheid. From the police force's abuse of power at Marikana to the unconstitutional decision by the NPA not to hand over the spy tapes as mandated by an order of the Supreme Court of Appeal, the respect for our constitution has been eroded. The court system of our democracy provides for uh, channels of recourse uh, for any party that uh, is aggrieved. That it's a matter that uh, we cannot unfortunately deal with uh, in a debate uh, in the House here. The Deputy President was also questioned on the upgrade to the President's Gandla home. Do you believe that spending so much money on the private home of a sitting head of state is justifiable when so many South Africans continue to live in poverty? I'm aware that the public protector is being approached uh, by your party, uh, Honourable Member, and that uh, no doubt she will uh, bring a, a report back to the South African public. Scopa and the Auditor General will also look into the matter. As an MBHSABC News Parliament.